So amblyopia is commonly known as lazy eye. It's the process by which the brain doesn't learn to see from either one or both eyes. It can be caused by lots of things, but importantly, it has to be corrected before the age of seven or eight, otherwise you've lost that opportunity and people have poor vision for the rest of their lives. Sometimes when we're in assembly or in class, I can't see the board and I have to walk up to it to see maybe what the math problem is or to read the text on the board for what we're doing in the morning. At school, um, everything has to be blown up and, um, and if we're reading a book, it has to be massive. So most children with amblyopia will come into clinic every few months for most of their life up until about seven or eight. To, to begin with, obviously we were relieved that she was having the treatment, but then the implication of having to go to the appointments um, became a bit of a burden. Um, so me and my partner had to take it in turns to take time off of work to um, be able to attend the appointments with Phoebe. In between taking Phoebe out of school, taking time off work and travelling to the hospital, um, it was just a lot of stress on us all really as a family. At the moment we don't use a lot of technology which is surprising because children walk around with amazing technology in their hands, in their homes, at school and yet we haven't really harnessed that for a lot of treatments in medicine but also in amblyopia. So what we're hoping to do is use technology which people have freely available to try and improve what we do, make it better, make it less of a stress and a burden for families and children and really reduce this vision loss that we still see because of amblyopia. So having the technology at home would help so much. We wouldn't have to take time off work, we wouldn't have to worry about travel, I wouldn't have to take Phoebe out of school and she could feel more comfortable and there'll be a lot less pressure as well. I would prefer to do the test at home because there have been times that sometimes I've missed out on fun things that I'm doing at school, maybe like art or science, um, and that my friends do. With your help, Southampton Hospital Cherry Tea can change lives like mine. Your support for this project could help us improve the vision and the quality of life for children with amblyopia. It could also help with their access to work, jobs, leisure activities in the future and for the rest of their lives. Your help could make a real difference. Thank you.